We still do, and we're taping yeah. also. Oh, yeah. huh? And we are taping also. Okay. Hey, everybody kind of gather over here in George Street, right there. G so gather under underneath your welcome sign. All right. Oh, yeah. yeah. Look at that. Yeah, that well, camera is live. So. The uh, camera behind that, me is live. That camera right there is going down. Oh, great. Uh, oh, that one. All right. So which way are we facing? That Face staff. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you're doing good. Good to right. see you. <laughs> yeah, you get all dressed up for us. I know. <laughs> <coughs> and Houston, how long uh, do we have KU for? Checking. Checking. Yeah, I know. I never go to station. How are we doing? Doing good. About uh, four and a half, five minutes. <laughs> four to five minutes. Oh, okay. All right, thank you. All right, cool. Beautiful. Well, we just want to take a moment to uh, welcome the crew of SDS-130 aboard uh, the ISS. Uh, we're happy to see our friends. Some of us are really happy because we haven't seen many people other than the crew for a long time. Um, and happy uh, that we're, we're coming close to the completion of the assembly of station with this mission. So really happy to have you guys on board. Jeff, we are glad to be here. It was absolutely beautiful coming on up. Uh, as we were looking in the window, we couldn't believe how spectacular and, and shiny the space station was. And uh, after a while, I just quit looking at it because uh, I just didn't want to think about uh, docking at this uh, big, beautiful station. And we're ready to uh, bring up uh, tranquility and cupola and work with you guys and, uh, and bring it to life. So this is a great day. Yeah, it's a great time. We're really looking forward to it. And uh, you folks on the ground, thanks to you, too, for uh, on both the station side and the shuttle side, KSC, JSC, Huntsville, and all the contractor locations around the country for the, your dedication uh, in making this all possible. Absolutely. Absolutely. Great job. Great job, everybody. All right. All right. Welcome on board. We're going right. to get on with a safety briefing. Yes. That's what we're going to do now. Okay. And uh, Houston, we'll leave this at your request. Since you requested it, we'll leave this mic hot for a little while. Okay, we copy all those uh, fine words, and uh, we'll listen in. Hey, guys. Look at me. One more. Walk with me. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, quick safety briefing, then we'll get back to work and start uh, getting everybody acclimated. I, today's a relatively relaxing day, though. I don't think it's yes. nothing to have done. So, um, we, you know, it'll be an easy day. At least you're not going into camp out today. Um, what I propose is that we'll pick up Columbus and the gym later in detail. We probably won't be going in there very much, uh, except for transfer and stuff. Uh, you know from, uh, I want to focus most of the time on, on this island, and we may defer the Russian segment depending upon the timeline, um, but we'll pick up the Russian segment before you get done uh, for safety briefing. I'll just remind you in Columbus uh, from here that there's uh, emergency equipment both at the, this end toward you, uh, to the left as you go through the head, 
and the far end behind those CTPs. Uh, like I said, you won't be spending a whole lot of time in there. But we'll cover it in a little bit more detail later. Uh, there's also a caution wire panel uh, back there, and there's uh, two ATUs, one at this end, so the right the end, and one at the far end. Uh, in the gym, we got emergency equipment. Uh, and it's there. And there's another set at the far end before you go into the JLP. You look up and you'll see the, the red mark. Uh, and then up in the JLP, way in the back, won't do you much good because you probably wouldn't find it anyway. There's a fire extinguisher behind a panel. Uh, well, actually, I think we're going to be... 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 We'll cover more of that in a little more detail later, too. Again, I want to focus on this here. Um, one thing I'll say right away before we start moving is uh, the hazards to the head is probably the, the biggest thing here translating around. Uh, you know, that's one of the things I worry about, someone getting bumped in the head, uh, because uh, there's a lot of stuff to bump in. So move slow and easy. I would ask you to... Uh, to Pay attention to where you're translating and not pulling cables and stuff. We've got a lot of cables to pull. Some of them have 120 volts in it. You've also uh, used the handrails and other structure. Uh, in the node here, node two, uh, of course, we've got a caution warning panel there, which you're familiar with. Uh, two ATUs. This is the active ATU. Consider this one not active, and it has to do with the two quarters. Uh, emergency equipment, we've got all of them. It has to do with the two quarters. We've got all emergency to do with the two quarters. Uh, emergency equipment. We've